In an age where streaming has practically become the norm for when people view their entertainment, it's nice that there's still plenty of content for people who use Blu-rays and DVDs. And as for people who've been fans of SpongeBob SquarePants since the very beginning, or just love the franchise as a whole in general, well I have great news for you because it has been officially announced that on October 15th, Nickelodeon is releasing the first 300 episodes of SpongeBob SquarePants, meaning you'll get all of seasons 1 to 13 and a little bit of season 14 from what I've heard. Now when I say 300 episodes I don't mean like it's gonna be like 311 minute segments like I'm talking about like 322 minute at least portions that means like every single sister episodes that were combined together that would always air side by side when the show airs on cable is all being put into this box set. Over 25 years worth of Spongebob content is coming into this very big box set that wow does it look pretty darn sizable. The, f the set is said to have 44 discs which contains every single episode up to this point, almost every single episode up to Spongebob's big 25th year, and it is set to release on October 15th of this special year for the sponge. Now, this isn't the first time something like this has happened, as back in 2009, around the time of Spongebob's 10th anniversary, Nickelodeon released the first 100 episodes on September 22nd, 2009, and as part of his 20th anniversary in 2019, they released the first 200 episodes. So this isn't the first time Nickelodeon has tried to do the complete series so far, as they have done this in the past for the other major Spongebob anniversary years. So, I suspect by Spongebob's 30th anniversary, which is going to be 2029, it's probably going to be the first 400 episodes if the show continues on, which I'm betting all my money that it will, or it could possibly be 500. I mean, all 500 episodes within, like, the big 30th year. That, that would be insane. The 300 episode box set is able to pre-order on Amazon right now, and from the last time I checked, it costs roughly $61.12, which may sound like a big price for a big box for a for a DVD nowadays, but you gotta remember, like I said, this thing has 44 discs in it which would probably, if you were to buy a normal DVD nowadays, it would probably be over a hundred dollars if you were to buy 44 DVDs, not counting Blu-ray. Probably well over a hundred dollars, maybe even 200 if if I'm accurate on that, I don't know. Plus, watching every single Spongebob episode up to this point would roughly take about over nine days straight with absolutely no breaks, and you'd probably go just as insane as Spongebob did when Mr. Krabs forced the Krusty crew to work 24 hours a day. Now, I've seen a lot of people compare this huge box set to something like the complete One Piece series or the complete Game of Thrones series, or even that Invader Zim, that specific Invader Zim box set where it's Zim's house with like every single episode. So this is this also isn't the first time a super weird and big DVD box set has released to the public. And like I said, with the with the age of stre with of streaming being the norm, it honestly makes me so happy that we're still getting stuff like this. Now time to talk about the box art. It's pretty similar to the 200 episode box art, with the front cover showing an exploding Spongebob, with pieces of him flying everywhere, while on the side it shows a very happy Spongebob greeting the audience. Now to be honest, I do prefer the art of the 200 episode box set because with the exploding pieces, they are a little bit more detailed, but that's only really a minor difference. They're both kind of the same, but I do wish they created something a little more original. And another complaint I do have with this is why is there no Blu-ray, at least from what I've heard? Like, to me and many other people who love physical media, it's really, really bothersome that a lot of cartoons like Spongebob, Family Guy, and more don't really get Blu-ray releases 
unlike other popular cartoons like Avatar The Last Airbender, Rick and Morty, Gravity Falls, etc. I mean, sometimes DVDs still look very good, despite not being as powerful as a Blu-ray disc. But, I mean, come on, Spongebob's movies are all on Blu-ray, so... Why not the show? But some stuff I really want to see from this box set is, like, just all of the behind the scenes, all of the great documentaries, all of the great promotional material. Like, I'd love to see some... Buckus, if there's one thing that is certain in this world, it's that you can't resist the formula. You know you can you. He's very much a Chris. Old Spongebob commercials on this thing, like the ones that were promoting the show before it first aired. I know that's probably not going to happen because DVDs don't usually do that anymore from the ones I've seen of recent movies, but man would it be so cool just to see all these like promotional material from when the show was airing at the time, like promos for like all the episodes from when they were new back in their days, like it, it would be awesome to see all the behind the scenes and um, great promotional material all like combined into this one ginormous package. SpongeBob SquarePants! Nickelodeon's newest, spongiest, square pantsiest Nicktoon! Pretty cool, huh? SpongeBob SquarePants, only on the best place to turn for new tunes in your Nickelodeon! I think this would really give the box set the edge to if you were to watch the show on a streaming service like Paramount Plus, as you wouldn't really get a lot of these bonus features that were featured on a lot of the old DVDs. It would be great if Nickelodeon just took them all and put them all in this huge package, so that way the not only the new generation can get inspired by the creativity behind the crew, or people who've been watching the show for years but have never really indulged in the behind-the-scenes content can finally get the chance to do so. And please, Give us a very fun DVD menu. If you put in any of the old Spongebob DVDs, that includes like any of the episodic DVDs and even the DVD of the first movie, the interactive menus may be a little quirky, but man, are they just, so, as a kid, like all these on like all the old Disney movies I watched as a kid or like any of the, like just any DVD I watched as a kid, there would always just be this super fun menu screen right before then with just all these original animations, all these original shots, and oh man, it just got me so hyped to indulge in, it just got me so hyped to just watch the movie or watch the show and I'm sure by including that you'll probably get someone who already loves Spongebob or is looking to revisit the show since childhood, you'll definitely get them happy. But anyways, that's all for now. The DVD set releases on October 15th and it's releasing at a pretty fair price for the box set that it is. I'm probably not going to get it right then and there. But for anyone who is not able to afford streaming and just wants a chance to revisit super fun childhood memories, then this box set is at a pretty fair price and you should definitely be on the lookout during October when it releases. And once again, even in the age of where streaming is the norm, I'm glad physical media is still able to thrive in its own way. But anyways, what do you guys think? Will you buy the box set when it comes out? Let me know in the comment section down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more great content and keep calm and let life carry you on.